What's up guys, the name's Ronan Dragnell and welcome back to the Crooked Man. So last we left off, uh, David tried to commit suicide because of the Crooked Man. But Paul to the rescue! So we managed to stop him and he came back to his senses. Now he has the address to this guy's house. And, oh. and now we are going to see what has happened and what we're doing here. So yeah, anyways, let us go forth. It's lo are you serious? Are you kidding me right now? Nothing's going in the planter. Do we have to find a key, really? Really? Is there anything behind the house? Is there anything? Anything in here? The mailbox says McGann. Must have been the resident's name. Trash can. A blue garbage can filled with rotten waste. Uh, freaking. What the hell? Where, where do I find the freaking key? What is this? Wait a minute. Do I have. Oh, bloody key. Hey! Unlock the door. Oh, it's, uh, pieces of shattered plates. Ooh. Broken mirror. Feels like it was struck with something. Dang. So beaten. Um. Old telephone. No power, so you can't make calls. Uh, there's nothing here. There's a note. Got a scrap from a notebook. I recalled the rhyme of the crooked man. All he could do was live in a crooked house with a cat and mouse just as crooked. I was the same way. Everything I wished for ended up crooked. My dreams, my love, even my family. How did the crooked man live? Was he sorrowful in the depths of despair? Such a life has no meaning. Okay. Not much fruit in the refrigerator. Of course it's gone bad. Stove is stained, garbage filled. I guess there's nothing here, so we can move on. Another note scrap. Shelves old junk. Uh tools and equip clean equipment, cardboard boxes. Another note. The hotel, the school, the hospital. Excuse me. It was the same at all of them. My saddest memories wouldn't go away. Writing wouldn't calm down my heart. In the end, my festering heart just oozed more, and I tear up the paper. Mine is an empty existence. Mine is an empty existence. I have nothing to leave behind, not even words. Oh, okay. Uh, so messy, man. Is that the wind? There's a strange voice coming from the radio. Oh. Nope. Nope. Nope, been out of that. Why? 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 No, 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 no. Ah, that was weird. Okay. Can you go upstairs? The ladder looks like a, the door does not open. Okay, that's just great. Painting must have fallen to the floor. Must have been hung on the wall. Got a scrap from a notebook. Out of cigarettes. I need to smoke. Hmm. Pile of paper scraps. They have very few words written on them. Pile of books. Almost nothing on the desk. A deflated, a deflated volleyball sits on top. Uh, this must be a black covered notebook. The rule on this notebook matches the scraps I have. Combine all the scraps, got a notebook. There's a name on the back. 
Duke. Duke Ma McGahan. Okay. Now what do I do? Do I hear sobbing? Ah, shit, it's you! Oh, no, I knew this day would come. I can't do this anymore. Ah! Is he crying? Shit, shit, no. Ah! Hi! Ow! Crooked man. I, I can't end up like you. He's up there, isn't he? Then I'll be going there. This will be the end. Okay, guys, prepare for a long ride because I don't know how long this will take because I'm a bad shooter. As you can see from the last time, I was trying to shoot him with Fluffy in the way and that just ended horribly. Okay, let's do this. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> uh. No, 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 no. Ah! No. Why can't I shoot him over there? This is so me. Nope, nope, nope. Ah! Shit. Nope, 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 nope! <laughs> Fucking! What? <laughs> um, I died. That's great. That's just great. Okay. Take, please tell me I'll be able to do this because this looks really hard. <laughs> nope, nope, no, no, no. Nope. I just fell for my own trap. Wow, that was stupid. That was super stupid. Okay. I'm not going to be like you. You won't catch me. As much misery as I encounter, as painful and bloody as it might be, I'll keep living. So, be gone! Hey, would you look at that? He's gone. Bye bye!
Oh, ooh, sun came out. It's early morning outside. Okay, I just needed full concentration. I didn't need to talk. That didn't take as much times as I had to. I only took a couple of times, but I did it. I just needed to not talk and focus. That is my main goal. Next time I need to focus and concentrate on things. Okay. I think... Please ignore that. Uh, I think we need to go upstairs. There's a door to the attic. You might be able to pry it open. Uh, sorry. Uh, something popped up. Um, open the door, of course. Duke. That's him? Oh no! Ah, uh, though, that looks, that still looks painful to look at. I can't. You, you detested me. Though I lived such a similar life, you hated how I lived comfortably. So, you wanted to drag me down to take me with you. But didn't you? Want to be saved? Deep down? So, you called me? No, that's not right. You wanted to help me. To tell me, don't come the way I've come. Thank you. Nothing will make you suffer anymore. Where you're going, it's a good place. So. Now, you can rest in peace. Uh, let's watch the ending. We need to know what happens. Wow, it must have been rough, David, finding a corpse on your trip. But it sounds like it ended all right. Oh, I'm, I'm Marion. Oops, I'm talking in that guy voice. Whoops, I'll go make some tea. He was beaten by the crooked man. He was dragged to the other side. The crooked man, who's always right behind me. I realized he was there. Every time I f was sad, I felt like he was whispering to me. I knew if I acknowledged it, I was done for. So I tried not to think about it. If all this hadn't happened, I'd think sooner or later I'd take his, pa his same path. Thinking of it that way? He really did save me. Always such an easy target, aren't you? That's why you got dragged into this. It's fine. The crooked man is gone. Hello? Huh? Uh, okay. I... I'll head right there. David? What's up? Who was it? The hospital. Mom's condition took a turn. They're going to have to do the operation. T take my bike. It'll be faster. You gotta go. Don't sit there staring. Oh man, hope his mom turns out, alright? Doctor! Doctor! Mom! Mom's condition! To be honest, this is rather risky. Removing the tumor isn't too difficult, but she might not have the strength to... Doctor, please! My mom! She's... She's the only family I have! Please! Sign this. We're getting ready now. We'll do the best job we can. 
Okay. Doctor! Mom! Mom! The tumor was successfully removed. She's still sleeping now. We might have a chance if she wakes up. Tonight will be the biggest hurdle. Have faith in her. David? Wait, sorry. My wrong voice. David? Mom! Mom! Oh, thank God. You woke up. You really? I felt like I was in darkness. I was scared. Screaming. I must have worried you. And those things I did to you. I'm so sorry. It was hard, wasn't it? It's okay. It's okay. You helped me open my eyes. Mom, I was so unhappy. I was just struggling to be happy. But I didn't give my mother the happiness she needed after all the hardship I'd given her. I foolishly doubted, thought I wasn't loved, wasn't needed. That's why I... Do you hate me for it? Don't be silly, David. Indeed, you bo and I both. It's hard to say we were always happy. But even in sad times, you were always honest. You lived a straight and honest life. I was so proud of you. Having you as a son was my greatest happiness. Don't focus on the sad things. And I'm sure you'll notice all the happiness hiding around you. Davy, I'm thirsty. Can you bring me some water? Sh sure, just a second. What? No! Here you go, Mom. Mom? No! Mom. She sent him away so that he didn't have to see her go. Oh my god, that's sad. This kind of hurts. This hurts, okay? That hurts. Damn. Oh, my heart. She got a good funeral. I'm sure your mother's happy now. You gotta be tired, huh, David? You okay? She told me she was happy in the end. If I'm going to live without blaming myself, those words are going to help a lot. It's fine if I have to suffer. If I can be smiling in the end. David. Marion? Why are you... Shirley? Why are you... Hey, Shirley! I still ain't forgiven you! How dare you give David the call... Okay, sorry, that was a girl voice. Okay, hold on. Ahem. Ow, 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 ow. Ahem. We're going. Okay, okay. Stop pinching me. Ooh, we're gonna get some alone time. Come on, Shirley, don't be a jerk. David, I heard about your mother. It's good you came, Shirley. 
Mom always liked you, so I bet she's glad. Thanks. David. I was... uneasy. I got unsure of where I was going, worried that the road I was walking would be full of twists and turns. So I took it out on you and your kindness. You never let me down, but how did I repay you? I'm really the worst of the worst. I'm sorry. Maybe this is too late, but... David? If it's okay with you, would you like to... Is he gonna... I went to... David? I'm sorry. Please, don't cry. No, I'm not sad. I'm just... Even though my dreams were crushed and I just lost my only family. I'm just so happy you came back. Oh, they're getting together again, but, um... I'm kind of shady about you, Shirley. I mean, I've gotten back in relationships and that has not ended well. So I have my eye on you, Shirley. I have my eye on you. Or eyes. I don't know. <laughs> oh, It's okay, Shirley. However... However off-kilter things get, we'll set them straight. I promise you. David. No. You know what I think? The crooked man had a crooked body and only crooked things. But I'm sure he was happy living in his crooked house. You're in a graveyard. What did you do? RIP to. You left up a pack of cigarettes. Oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. I hope to see you again. Until then, rest in peace. Good end. Bye bye, Blackbird. Yay, we got the good end! Oh, whew. And that's it. That's the end of the Crooked Man. Okay, we're gonna let the credits roll out. Okay, so I have seen playthroughs of this, and I was just like, no, I'm not gonna play this. But you guys suggested I play it, and I played it, and oh my gosh, I don't regret it. I really don't. This is really such an awesome game, and I I couldn't... I, I will probably play it again. Uh, my fear is have gone down the drain, so I'm not afraid of the Crooked Man anymore. We're just, you know, yeah. I'm really glad, I'm really glad you guys suggested this game, that I play it. Helped me, I conquered this, and I'm glad I did, cause I was able to beat the Crooked Man, and yeah. Oh, I'm just so glad. Hmm. This was actually a really nice game. I, I wouldn't mind playing it back again. I wouldn't mind watching people watch it again. Watch the people play it again. You know. End. Okay. Yeah. That's it. I just said some good things about this game. The story was good. The characters were good. You know, all that. Oh, what's this? Thank you for playing the Cricket Man. And congrats on the good ending. This is a bonus area. You'll lose access to it if you quit, so I recommend making a save. You can also begin a second playthrough. Oh, that's cool. About the second playthrough. The door at the top leads to a second playthrough. There's no change in story, battles, or choices, but some events near the ending change. Please try it if you're interested. Second play will be indicated. Playthroughs th three and up have no changes. Hmm. About the series. This ends The Crooked Man, but I'd like to make a series of similar games. I hope you play them when they come out. They'll be available on my blog. And about the game. This impetus to create the game came from a strange event that happened to a friend of the author. Writing it all would be, be too long of a story, unfortunately. It might be available on my blog. This game is less scary than my last game, Paranoiac. Ooh, but I considered having more action in this one. The author will be delighted if you enjoyed it. Again, thank you for playing. Okay, we're going to save with 
call. Yeah. Okay, so... Okay, we finished the Crooked Man. There's a second playthrough. I don't think I'm gonna play it. I might. I don't know for sure. But I do know, if you guys know me from seeing me comment on Madam Sharky's channel a lot, I know that there's a second... There's a sequel to this game, and it's called The Sandman. And indeed, she played it. I was, I loved it. I saw the playthrough. I love the game so much. There's even a character with my nickname, Sophie. So, uh, yes, I will be playing that, but not now. We're going to move on to another game. Oh, jeez. I got some good recommendations for games, but if you have some, just tell me in the comments below, and we'll play them next week. So, yeah. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this... Uh, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys like to see more of my videos, then click subscribe. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!